Hey everybody, uh, this is Andrew Lewin. Uh, this is my vlog. I've kind of done this vlog on and off before. I kind of had a little bit of a title, Thoughts from a Car, because I do most of my vlogging in a car. Uh, but this, I decided to start it up again because I'm about to go on this interesting journey. Uh, it's, uh, some of you who may know me, I you know tend to know that I've, in the last year and a half, I've gotten interested in, um, uh, in CrossFit. Uh, and trying to get healthy uh, and you know I'm a little addicted to CrossFit I have to admit I, I work out about four or five times a week and it's great and I've been eating a, a paleo type diet for I would say 80% of the time and it's wonderful it's been wonderful but I decided over the next eight weeks I'm going to try something new uh, a friend of mine has uh, went with a nutrition coach uh, and he's been eating uh, a different style, and I'll tell you in a minute, uh, but he's gotten great results from it. He works about six times a week. He probably works out a little more intensely than I do, but I, uh, you know, he's lost like a crazy amount of weight. He looks fantastic. Um, and uh, to be honest, I, I want similar results. You know, I want to be healthy and I want to I want to be lean as I'm getting older. You know, the health problems are going to come along and I don't want to, I want to do my best to actually reduce that that amount so I've started this eight-week journey on and I to be honest I forget what the name of it's called this kind of nutrition plan um, but essentially it's it's tracking and counting your food so what I do is I the, the coach puts me on a specific plan so the plan is it's counting macros so macros is fats proteins and carbs carbohydrates so what I do every day is I, I have a certain amount set amount of uh, fats in grams, protein, and carbohydrates that I have to hit uh, so that I can eat properly. So my coach on training days, I have to hit 85 grams of fat, uh, 180 grams of protein, and 275 grams of carbohydrates. On non-training days, where I'm just doing like cardio or something like that, or play hockey or something, uh, I have to hit 85 grams of fat, 180 grams of protein and 250 grams of carbs and then I have this like big low day uh, they call it like a refed day I think uh, and that is where um, I have to hit same fat so 85 grams of fat protein 180 grams uh, and 350 grams of carbs which is a lot but you know it's, I think it's kind of nice because I've been kind of tracking it so I start today today is Thursday uh, April 9th I start today and I go for eight weeks so what I plan on doing is I plan on just kind of this is kind of like a bit of a video journal so I guess it's a vlog of my journey through that so every day I'm gonna plan on doing um, or I'm gonna try every day to plan on doing a video to kind of track it and, and it could be for you guys if you want to help if you want to follow what I'm doing and see my results and see how I feel throughout the whole time but it's more for me to kind of watch it and, and just kind of see my journey and remember the journey that I had and, and you know what specifics I've had because I've been on eating plans before um, and I felt you know up and down in certain times and I've never really remembered at what point I felt up or down or whatever um, so I kind of want to track those changes uh, so this is I'm kind of doing this on I put it on YouTube for anybody else who wants to watch it so uh, so today is my first day I'm kind of excited I've uh, I was a little worried before I started because I uh, also sorry uh, this vlog is probably for my coaches I'll probably refer them to this little vlog because I have to kind of keep a journal so anyway um, today's my first day I was a little worried about hitting the amount of carbs and protein because I haven't really tracked it before and I don't really know if I actually hit that the, like the right amount um, so I was a little worried so two days ago on Tuesday and Wednesday I decided to actually do like a dry run so to speak um, and I actually was able to hit a, a certain amount and what I noticed is I had to plan everything out beforehand so what I did on Monday Monday evening I went on this app called my fitness pal and which allows you to break down all the foods in terms of carbohydrates fats uh, and protein and also it tells you other things like vitamins and stuff it, it allows you to, to weigh like it allows you to put in a certain amount of grams or anything like that so I did that and I would I would I would basically weighed out all my food and I put the tractor in to see what I need to actually hit 
to get like the one in what I need to actually eat to hit the 180 protein 275 carbs and 85 grams of fat now coming from a paleo diet where the you know you're hitting a lot of fat you're hitting about 100 to 150 grams of fat so you know having a lot of eggs a lot of bacon that kind of stuff um, it was going to be a lot more difficult for me to keep the fats down or I thought anyway so I was I planned out all my stuff for the last two days and I seem to be able to hit everything and I don't feel overly full I don't feel hungry at all um, I feel actually very nicely satisfied uh, which is great because on that when I was doing paleo like strict paleo I'd always feel hungry I'm always worried about something for me my big vice is chocolate and cravings this allows me to have a little bit of chocolate when I want as long as I plan it out, as long as it falls within my macros, and of course, in moderation, right? So it allows me to do that, um, and I don't get like the big cravings for something. And I'm not always thinking about food because I'm always satisfied. My stomach is always satisfied. So, uh, so it feels great. So I'm really excited today to start. Um, I did a workout today. So Thursdays at our CrossFit at 6 a.m., we do an ollie lifting class, an Olympic Olympic lifting class, which is really fun because it allows me to work on my technique. A, a lot of stuff and it allows me to bring uh, build my strength um, and which is which is which is nice so today we worked on uh, you know snatches which is an Olympic lift and cleans uh, which is you know which is a lot I actually enjoy cleans a lot um, I can only do power cleans and snatches because my knee I'm having a problem with my knee right now um, but I was pretty I was pretty happy with my technique uh, today and I'm actually getting heavier in, in weights on my on my uh, power snatch and I feel myself getting stronger Before when I did these ollie lifting classes I didn't feel like I got a good workout But now I actually because I'm adding more weight and doing the weight I probably should have been doing a while ago. Um, I feel tired after uh, you know, just like a regular CrossFit workout, so um, So I feel good about that and I feel like I'm gaining a lot of muscle doing that and I'm hoping to continue on with that kind of uh with that kind of plan um and then food today i had my i had my chicken this morning uh, i had a banana before working out uh not too much food of course uh because i don't want to be sick during my workout uh but then you know i had my uh my eggs and, and everything else uh my I had, I had three eggs scrambled uh some more chicken uh chicken thighs which is a little higher in fat but it's okay it's still under my 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 uh my fat content for what i need and I had some cereal, some raisin bran, uh, so it's kind of up my fiber a little bit uh, and get my carbs in. So and I feel great. I'm gonna have a protein shake this this uh, this morning, uh, and I look forward to eating the rest. So I'm pretty excited. I'm hoping that I'll start to see changes uh, in about two weeks, just an energy level, uh, as well as just overall like you know, happiness uh, once I get used to everything. And it'll be a lot easier. Right now, it's a lot of weighing. I'm hoping that eventually I'll get to a point where I can kind of eye things out. And say oh yeah this is 100 grams of chicken or this is 100 grams of potatoes or, or whatever so that's it for me today uh, i'll check in tomorrow and uh i hope you enjoy this journey that i look forward to all right see you later bye